It is written, whoever humbles themselves shall be exalted. Lord Jesus, the scripture says, you hate the proud, but favors the humble. We want to be on your side. That is why at this moment, we kneel down before the throne of grace. We know, my Lord Jesus, that there is no other thing. There is no other place. There is no other position better than learning at the lost feet. I remember when we entered the house of Martha. The scripture says she was worried and upset about many things. Preparing the meal for you. But the younger one went on her knees and sat at your feet. And when Martha realized that her sister was not assisting her with the house chores, she came and said, look at what I'm doing. Why can't you come and assist? And the Bible says, you said, Martha, Martha, you are worried and, and upset about many things, but only one thing is needed. Mary has chosen it and it will never be taken away from her. Since then, I understood that the only thing that we need in this world is to kneel down before the throne of grace and learn from your feet, oh Lord Jesus. There is no other position. There is no other place better than that. And you promised me at the beginning of this year that as I kneel before your throne, my enemy shall bow down. I don't need to pray for my enemies. It is a waste of time. I don't need to wish them ill because they are your creation. The scripture says, the Lord sat before me and before my enemies at table. Lord Jesus, until I leave this world, I am born to kneel before the throne. I am born to walk before the throne. I am born to talk before the throne. I am born to worship the master, the Messiah, the king of glory the ancient of days the alpha and the omega the beginning and the end the one who was who is and who is to come i am born to worship the great yahweh the great i am the king of glory the master of the universe the word is your name lord jesus Keep us in this position. It takes a sacrifice to live my whole life on my knees. Lord Jesus, I pray for this church this year and many more years to come. May we be a church on their knees. May we be a people on their knees before the throne of grace. May pride never be our identity. May arrogance be far from our camp. May haughty eyes never be part of us. We want to live with you. We want to walk with you. We want to talk with you from the beginning of this year. Here we are. Receive our poor souls. Wash us with your precious blood sanctify us my lord jesus deep us in the river that flows from the throne the river of fire which the scripture speaks about my bible says that you are in charge of our hearts turn their hearts 
to you my Lord Jesus and make them see your beauty the beauty of worship the beauty of the Son the beauty of the Father in the name of Jesus we pray wherever you are child of God on your knees open your heart and ask him that he may keep you for the rest of your life on your knees come on lift up your voice and pray and worship the master of the universe worship the creator worship the great Yahweh worship the morning star worship him who was who is and who is to come worship him the alpha and the omega worship him the beginning and the end worship him who has been before the creation of the world at the lost side bless the name of your father and say to him this is how i want to live my life i want to live my life on my knees oh lord jesus come upon the church come upon your people come upon these christians and make them yours make them your people make them born again capture their hearts adopt them and make them your people worship him worship him holy spirit adopt me make me one of your own lord jesus adopt me to belong to your family holy spirit adopt me make me one of your own lord jesus adopt me to belong to your family holy spirit adopt me
in the name of Jesus Christ.